Before tip-off, Bethlehem Catholic took some time to honor their three seniors, but from then on, it was game time. Things looking pretty good for Easton, up 10-5, six minutes into the game, but here comes Talia Medina with the only three, scored in the first quarter, putting eight on the board for Becca. To open the scoring in the second quarter, here's Kyla Smith to give Easton the 16-11 lead. Hope Brown puts up her first three of the night. The Golden Hawks just one point behind. With 35 seconds left in the half, Becca draws the foul and sinks a free throw for the 23-22 lead at half. Picking things up with four minutes to go in the third, Smith pivots to get this one in around Medina. Rovers up 28-25. Closing off their six-point run with one minute left. Smith happy about this one, I don't blame her. Puts the Rovers up 34-27. At the start of the fourth, Easton only up by one. Here comes Morgan Orlowski taking back the lead for the Golden Hawks, 36-34. Not too happy about that score. Michaela Roach gives back not just one, but two straight threes for the Rovers. Three minutes left in the game. Lena Deegan takes it to the hole. Just two of the 17 she had on the night. Hawks up 46-40. And that would be the last two of the game. The last points came from the foul line. Easton getting some revenge on Becca, 53-42. to Oh, it feels good for, for a lot of reasons. They're certainly one of the better teams in the area, state champs last year. And uh, we were both 12-1 and in the league going into this game. So it was a crucial game for, for us, and I'm very happy to come out with a win. Our theme most of the season is they're a very good team. They're going to have their run, play through it. I think we did a good job in the first half. And... Uh, because they did that, we were only down one at half, and uh, we've been a very good second half team all year, and uh, I knew that it was going to be a close game, and uh, we, we were very fortunate. We have a lot of good ball handlers. I think that's the main thing, and uh, um, our guards are really good. They're strong with the ball. They make smart decisions, and Leanna Deegan, um, for our big, it, it handles the ball really well, and she's a tough matchup. Oh, well, both times knew they were going to be a really tough team to play. We practiced hard, and... Um, I think we played a really well, a really good defensive job. Um, we also knew their key players like uh, Talia and Hope. We knew we had to come out on them and we had our best defenders on them. What a time to be in Easton Red Rover. Not only did they get revenge on one of the only two teams that defeated them this season, but they broke school history. Last year they capped 14 wins in a row, but tonight they made a new school record hitting 16. Well, we came off of a big high. We got 15 wins in a row, which is our team record. So this is 16 now. So we were really motivated to get that, and um, she's coming off this victory. We're going to have a lot of confidence, but we still know we're going to have to work hard. It's really special, and our class is really happy with that. We've been working really hard all these four years, and it just feels really good. On the scene at Bethlehem Catholic, I'm Jenica Volsky for Two Sports.